Oh, Finn, is that your new girlfriend? You guys are such a cute couple. Well then, duck opinion. Zombies! What's up guys, Duck Opinion here and the trailer for the last map pack Origins revealed today. Check it out. Origins is exactly what it says on the tin. We're going back to the very moment where the four heroes meet for the first time. Nikolai, Dempsey, Takio, and of course, Richtofen. But this is not for the faint hearted. That these characters are meeting surrounded by the horrors of war. We have a larger scale than we've ever done before, further enhanced by dynamic weather from rain, fog rolling in, snow falling. In true zombie style, our World War One has a thematic twist, diesel punk. The map features two new era-specific weapons, the MG-08 machine gun, wow, and a new starting pistol for the first time, which is the Mauser. Now, both have been given the diesel punk kind of aesthetic. We've introduced the zombie tank. This is a defendable platform that will move around the map, which you can use to fighting off the zombie hordes, and also possibly discover some Easter eggs along the way. Oh, by the way, did I mention the giant robots? We have 1,000-foot mechanical giants striding across the landscape. That gives a verticality and scale that we've never seen before in zombies. It also provides hazards or opportunities for the skilled player. This zombie's map really has to be seen to be believed. So what do you guys think about the new map Origins? There's a lot of things I want to go over, but more than anything, I want to play it here in a couple weeks. We have tons of games and updates coming out. It will be a very busy end of the month. So let's Origins is get exactly into it. it. In the We're going back to the very moment where the four heroes meet for the first time. Nikolai, Dempsey, Takio. I don't really care too much about the characters. They were not like, the it's whatever. When I used to play this game back in the day, I didn't really pay too much attention to the characters. But I do love before. when they show Further footage like that of them making the, rain, the game on the computer. So let's in, draw back to that. And it uh, looks really cool because in the middle here on the, on the right side image, that's a huge circle spot. Like, I could circle there to around a billion if I wanted to, but it looks like a huge map when you actually watch the full clip. It's looking like one of the biggest maps yet. In true zombie style, our World War One has a thematic twist, diesel punk. The map features two new era-specific weapons, the MG-08 machine gun, wow, and a new starting pistol for the first time, which is the Mauser. Now, both have been given the diesel punk kind of aesthetic. Now the MG looks great. I can't wait to pack a punch it, but the Mauser, I mean, it's just gonna be a starting pistol. It looks really cool, but it's gonna suck. We're gonna have to get something better fast. We've introduced the zombie tank. This is a defendable platform that'll move around the map, which you can use to fighting off the zombie hordes and also possibly discover some Easter eggs along the way. Of course we will discover Easter eggs along the way, but I think this little movable tank thing is a viable tank that will move from spot to spot around the map, letting you cross some areas and holding you back from crossing other areas that's in kind of like the little pit area. So that's what I'm thinking this little tank mechanic is. We'll find out in a couple weeks, but let's continue on our analyzation of this video. Oh, by the way, did I mention the giant robots? We have 1,000 foot mechanical giants striding across the landscape. That gives a verticality and scale that we've never seen before in zombies. It also provides hazards or opportunities for the skilled player. This zombies map really has to be seen to be believed. So hazards or opportunities. They said the same thing about Huckleberry and Buried, and he is not a hazard. I mean, he is kind of, but he's so much more helpful than he is a hazard. So will the robot be the same? Will he open up accesses to new points? Will he open up perks? What will this robot do? And can you take him down with a new wonder weapon that they didn't show? Maybe like some electrical pulse to turn him off. And going back to this image, I love images that just have like the computer screen showing him working on it. It looks really cool, but what is this huge beacon in the middle of the map? So many questions in this video, so many questions unanswered. Can't wait to check it out and answer them all in a couple weeks when Origin comes out for Xbox 360. It's going to be really fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Like it, give it a thumbs up, and if any more news comes up before the map comes out, I'll let you guys know. Dust can fly. Peace.